good morning welcome to my spring morning routine i did all my little small morning things of the day read my bible did my little five minute prayer journal watered my flowers made my coffee and i just finished washing my face and now i'm doing my skincare i'm using some of this typology nine ingredients soothing face serum i'm actually working with typology on today's video if you guys watch my channel if this like isn't your first time to see me chances are you've probably seen me talk about typology because I am so obsessed with them. If you guys don't know who Typology is, they are a French-based brand. They make products that are skincare-based with like makeup benefits. So they have a tinted serum, which I absolutely love. They have a concealer, just so many different products, but they're all skincare-based. So it just has a ton of incredible benefits for your skin. This one, I absolutely love. I use this every single morning. It just really helps to hydrate my skin. It's very, very soothing. It helps calm like redness, inflammation. And then lately, I've also been using this nine ingredient face moisturizer this one's a little bit thicker but my skin's just been so so dry lately so i've really been liking to kind of pair these two together but anyways like i said typology is actually a french brand which is really cool because they're actually held to the european standards of what like goes into their products they actually have over 1300 different ingredients that are banned from their products so you really know with typology what you're putting on your skin is good for you and it's good for your skin it doesn't have a ton of these really nasty chemicals that a lot of brands do put into their skincare so absolutely love that about typology i'll show you guys my whole little no makeup makeup look with typology a little bit later because those are truly some of my favorite products but right now i think i'm actually going to go take the pups on a little walk i've been really trying to be good about getting in at least 30 minutes of some kind of movement every morning and i've also been trying to cycle sync a bit more i've been really looking into like how you know different exercise at different points of your cycle really affects your body and your hormones so that's been super interesting to me and i definitely feel a lot better whenever i do cycle sync so since i'm a little bit later in my cycle Cycle, instead of going to like a really high intensity spin class i'm going to opt for something that's a little bit more low impact a little bit more calming like a nice long walk and also it's such a sunny day outside today and the dogs are so hyper and they want to get out and go run around so it's gonna be a great walk i also feel so good whenever i get in some fresh air and sunshine first thing in the morning so we're gonna go take them on a nice long walk out of the shower washed my hair did a full everything shower i'm just gonna put in some of this divi scalp serum if you guys have never heard of it it's so great it um like really helps to detoxify your scalp it helps to nourish it and supports like hair growth if you have like dry scalp at all it really helps with that um it just has so many like different benefits to it and it just really helps to keep your scalp healthy so really really like this stuff this is like my third or fourth bottle of it it is a little pricey but so worth it in my opinion and then you just kind of massage it all in, like tangling up my freshly brushed hair. And then while I'm waiting for my hair to dry a little bit, I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup. Um, I try to let my hair dry at least like 80% before I start putting heat on it. If you guys wanna know how I've been doing my makeup, this has been my go-to routine almost every single day, pretty much any day that I'm not wearing like a full face of makeup. So unless I'm like going out to a dinner or something like that, and I'll still incorporate these products. So if you guys are like me and you like a very fresh, clean, no makeup makeup look while having like a ton of awesome skincare ingredients in your products typology is definitely for you oh my gosh wait i got fuzz on that the first thing i'm putting on is this tinted serum i'm in the shade type one fair and i love this one because it has a vitamin c it has aloe um so again it's skincare with makeup benefits which i think is awesome because i can put this on my skin and have it on there all day knowing that not only do i have like a really pretty glowing face but all the skincare is doing its magic at the same time so i think that's super cool and really unique i honestly haven't found like another product that's really like that usually it's more like makeup focused but I really like that they really focus on like the skincare. Okay, so this is how my skin is looking with literally just the tinted serum on and nothing else. You guys can already tell that covered up so much and really just overall evened out my skin tone. It looks just so, so much better. Gives a really nice, fresh, like beautiful glow as well. And then after the tinted serum, I like to go in with their serum concealer. Again, this one is in the shade Type 1 Fair. This one is great because not only is it so hydrating and just absolutely melts into your skin. Like when I say it melts into your skin, I mean like it is like butter that just like hydrates your under eye or like wherever you put it. But it also has caffeine, which is really great. So especially for like your under eye, it really helps to like depuff 
wake you up kind of help with like dark circles it just makes your skin look so good especially with that under eye area it just is so nice and hydrating i feel like sometimes concealers can be a little bit drying or almost like make my under eyes almost like flaky um but this one does not this one is like insanely hydrating it just feels so nice also it works so well to cover up like any spots or hyperpigmentation that you have okay you guys can already see like how much brighter my under eye is on that side it just looks so good and it's super super glowy and hydrated too and then after that i like to use some of this lip oil and this is in the shade powder pink again this one has a ton of incredible skincare in it it has squalene jojoba oil and vitamin e so lots of things to really help like hydrate your lips i also like this because it's multi-use so not only is it for your lips but i also like to use it on my cheeks to give it a little bit of a blush and it's just really nice again and hydrating and makes your just cheeks so so glowy i just like to put a few dots on here and it's just really nice light and subtle and i also like that it's very buildable so if you want a little bit more you can add more if you want less you know you can just do a few dots and it's just going to give like a very nice subtle like pink to your cheeks these are super easy just to apply with your hands as well but it just gives such a nice natural light pink color i'm going to put a little on my nose as well I feel like I really should be doing this in the mirror, not the viewfinder. I would probably turn out a little bit better, but super easy, very quick and simple to do. Okay, just added on a little bit of brow gel. And then my last step is gonna be using some of this serum mascara. This one's great, it has pea peptides in it. Again, everything is skincare based. So even the mascara has incredible ingredients in it. But I like this one because it's very soft, very natural. Again, we're not going for like harsh, crazy makeup here. Just a very natural, very light, a very like easy, clean girl, no makeup makeup look, which is right up my alley this is like my favorite kind of makeup look it's also so simple and takes like hardly any time at all okay and then that is it for mascara you guys can see it definitely gives your lashes like a little boost but it's just very natural and light it almost kind of reminds me of like a bit of a lash tint but that's my little no makeup makeup look it's definitely the most just like glowy natural in my opinion like beautiful easy spring summer look if you aren't wanting to do like a full face of makeup but you're still wanting to get in some good skincare and have the makeup benefit with that as well so if you guys do want to check out typology i'll have everything that i use linked down below and if you guys use my link and spend 40 dollars, you can actually get a free by phase eye makeup remover with your order when i tell you that this stuff is literally the best eye makeup remover i've ever used there's no like aggressive scrubbing on your eyes it just melts everything off so so beautifully and it's a huge bottle so for me it's lasted a really long time i've had this for months and i'm only to like right there so if you guys use my link and spend at least 40 dollars, you'll get a free one of these so definitely check them out i promise you will absolutely love them like i cannot tell you guys how much i love these products you guys probably have already gathered that from seeing them in every single one of my videos for like the last six months but anyways okay i'm gonna go ahead and blow dry and do my hair i'm actually going to style it today most days i let it air dry or just like put it up but i have some other content and stuff to shoot today so i'm going to go ahead and finish up getting ready okay i just finished curling my hair and it is already wanting to go straight i don't know why my hair does this i don't know if anyone else has hair like this my natural hair is very wavy so you think it would one hold on to the curl but no it just wants to kind of go straight so i might end up honestly i think i might just put my hair and do a little half up half down situation i also honestly just love having my hair like up out of my face and i got the cutest little clips at target the other day i was like checking out and i saw these in the little checkout lane and i love them Okay, a little wonky, but that's okay. We're gonna go with it. And then I'll put on some cute earrings and everything later when I get dressed. But right now I'm gonna go get some breakfast. I've been trying to be really good about not having any caffeine before I eat and then also having caffeine a little bit later in my morning. So this morning I just had a decaf latte. So I'm like, I need my caffeine. I am feeling it. So let's go make some breakfast.
breakfast, I'm making one of my current obsessions. I can't stop eating it, it's so good. But I'm making this really yummy berry crumble that I found on Pinterest. It's gluten-free, refined sugar-free, vegan, all the things. Super easy, simple to make. And I found the most perfect little single size dish at Target the other day. So I really have been wanting to use it and make a little berry crumble. I like this because you still get some oats and so you get some protein and then lots of fresh berries. And it's just such a warm, cozy, yummy breakfast. So if you guys do wanna make it, I'll have the recipe linked down in the description. Highly recommend, it is so, so good. And then of course we have Sir Dupin stuffs down here. Do you always like to just sit in the most inconvenient places, don't you? He's fully taken over the kitchen. Like anytime I'm in here cooking, he will always just lay right down at my feet, like right in the middle of the floor where I need to be standing. So I'm constantly stepping over him and he just could not care. Is that right, Kaiser Duke? Is that what you do? Yeah, that's what you do. You're such a good boy, love you. My berry crumble just came out of the oven. It looks so good. I cannot wait to eat this. Oh my gosh, my mouth is drooling just looking at that. With my berry crumble for some caffeine, I'm also gonna have one of these little magic mind shots. I have really been loving these lately and they have a ton of really good stuff in here. They have like nootropics, matcha adaptogens, some vitamins. So just a ton of really good things in here. And I noticed that I don't get any like jitters. I just feel a lot more calm, feel like my mind is really clear. So I've really been loving these in the morning, but it is so, so nice outside. So I think I'm gonna take my shot and my little berry crumble and go eat outside on the patio. to figure out what I'm gonna wear. I was planning on wearing this outfit today, which I absolutely love. I just got in a ton of super, super cute stuff from Princess Polly, so I'll have to do a haul for you guys soon. But I'm wearing this super oversized sweater. I love the sleeves. I think it's so, so cute. And then I just paired it with these super cozy linen pants that are also from Princess Polly. I really like these because they have little cute pockets and they also have a little drawstring on them too, which I like, but they are seriously just so, so comfy. A really great link. Obviously you guys saw them on me. They're like nice, flowy, and long. And I love them. So I'll link these in a haul coming up. So stay tuned for that. But I think I'm honestly gonna change out of this sweater because it is a little warm outside today and I was getting hot when I was just sitting outside eating my breakfast. So I think I'm gonna change. Okay, I think this is the shirt I'm gonna wear. I really like this. I actually got this off of Amazon. Wait, no, I probably should just tuck this part in. Um, I actually got this one off of Amazon and it is such good quality. It's so, so cute, super lightweight. And it's just been like, I'm, I've been so excited to wear it because I love the way that it looks. Anyways, but this one is definitely a lot more lightweight, very nice and cool, just super oversized and very, very comfy. So very breathable and great for like spring and summer weather. And then I got this bag off of Amazon a little bit ago. So I was planning on pairing it with this. And then I also got these super cute sunnies from Princess Polly, which again, I'll have all the links for all the Princess Polly stuff in my upcoming video. 
And then earrings, I'm trying to decide between either these little drop ones or these super cute ones that I also just got from Princess Polly. I think I might go with these ones. I also really love outfits with sunglasses because it is such a windy day, so I love just being able to like push up my hair and I feel like it still looks cute, but it like gets it out of my face and it's not gonna be like going everywhere. Okay, I left my other earrings in my closet. I was like unboxing all the stuff in there, but okay. So I think those are the little earrings I'm gonna go with today. Love the way they look. And then last but not least, of course, I'm gonna do some perfume. This one is Missy by Rosie Jane. This has been my current favorite. It's very like coconutty. I think it has hints of, what else was it? Coconut, green mandarin, and then something else in there. And it was just very, oh, pineapple, pineapple. It's just very sweet, fruity, very beachy. Great for the spring and summer, but not like too overwhelming. I did so many compliments on it. So anyways, that is my little outfit of the day but I'm gonna wear I just paired it with my Nike AF ones and I just think it's such a cute outfit very simple very minimalistic but I love the way that it looks and I think it's perfect for the spring time so that's my little outfit of the day but I'm gonna go ahead and head out I have some errands to go run I think I'm gonna go stop by a coffee shop and edit there for a little bit just to get out of the house but I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one